हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू फिजिक्स वाला गेट वाला आई माय सेल्फ शिवम दीक्षित वेलकमिंग यू ऑल ऑन दिस ब्यूटीफुल सेशन रिलेटेड टू एरो स्पेस इंजीनियरिंग वी ऑल नो दैट अर्लियर गेट वाला हैव मेनी ब्रांचेस राइट इफ यू वांट टू प्रिपेयर फॉर गेट देन मैकेनिकल वाज द ऑप्शन सीएस कंप्यूटर साइंस सिविल इंजीनियरिंग इलेक्ट्रिकल इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स प्रोडक्शन करेक्ट देन इंजीनियरिंग साइंसेस instrumentation right so there are many branches basically da also right so there are many branches and uh, this year we are adding two more branches one is aerospace engineering and uh, another one is environmental science so the student who are pursuing btech from the aerospace engineering and they want to write gate uh, they want to uh, go for mtech from iic or iit or they want to go for psus then they have to write the gate exam so if they want to per, uh, like prepare for the gate exam then now gate wala is uh, providing a special batch for aerospace engineering earlier also student were preparing aerospace uh, students were preparing through gate wala but in mechanical branches so there are some of the subject like flight uh, mechanics and uh, aerodynamics some portion of aerodynamics aerothermodynamics some portions were there which is not covered in mechanical now a separate branch is launched that is aerospace engineering uh, and uh, every single thing is going to be covered right don't worry so here uh, today's agenda is basically two things are there the one the student who is who is pursuing their btech from aerospace engineering and uh, they want to know what are the opportunities they have after gate and the second one is the student who are preparing from uh, like preparing for gate in their their branch which is other than aerospace engineering like some students might be from mechanical engineering some students are from electrical electronics uh, computer science or any other engineering and they have option of uh, writing the aerospace engineering you all know that nowadays uh, you can write the gate exam with two papers the first is your core paper let's say i am a mechanical engineer so i can write the gate exam through mechanical engineering now as a second paper i have multiple options in mechanical engineering uh, we have option of uh, engineering sciences xc we have uh, option of uh, uh, production engineering right we have op and and we have option of aerospace engineering so why to choose that aerospace engineering as a second paper right that is one discussion and uh, uh, whether whether a aerospace student a student who is doing their btech from aerospace engineering they should write the gate exam or not this is two basic things that i am going to discuss here the first thing first uh, uh, the student who are pursuing btech from aerospace engineering i say i i i must say they have to write they have to write the gate exam every single student have to write gate sir but i don't want to pursue for mtech then also you should write right i'm telling you there are multiple factors there are multiple benefits of writing gate exam uh, let me ex uh, explain this one by one the very first thing when you choose this aerospace engineering it means that you you have already chosen the sky and we know that sky don't have limits right and it is just a beginning i'm telling you btech is just a beginning right you have to go very long i'm telling you see if a student is choosing computer science it means that in their in their mind somewhere it is there then after just after btech i will get some good job and i will go for that job right this is a mentality of most of the students of the computer science whereas if you talk about the core branches like civil engineering mechanical electrical electronics so they are also mentally prepared that either i will get job just after btech or i will prepare for gate or any other competitive exam right for one year and then uh, i i'll go for some uh, government job or something right but when you choose aerospace engineering means what i personally like when i interact with the student who are writing the aerospace uh, 
who are actually uh, doing BTEC from aerospace branch. So their aim is basically to uh, get into the research, right? Get into the research. So if you want to get into the research, then the very first step is to write the gate and pursue for the MTech and then go for either PhD or any research organizations like ISRO, DRDO, uh, CSIR. There are many organizations where aerospace students are uh have like recruited right uh so this is the very first one so the student who are preparing for like who are actually pursuing their btech in aerospace engineering and uh, i i i this is just a suggestion that you must have to write the gate exam you have multiple opportunities after writing gate exam like you can go iisc bangalore one of the finest institute for the aerospace engineering right so you can go for aerospace engineering in a isc bangalore then most of the iits have this branch right so you can pursue your mtech from uh, aerospace then you have option of psus right many psus are there like uh, where number of vacancies are there related to aerospace branch even you can go for ms from abroad right through this gate exam itself right so there are multiple opportunities so i must say that if someone is doing their btech from aerospace engineering then they must have to appear for gate exam and uh, one another fact that uh, uh, you already know that gate wala is one of the most uh, premium affordable institute uh, for gate preparation right if you go and see our results last year results in mechanical electrical electronics ec iron right and other branches then you will find in top 10 in top 10 most of the branches most of the branches in top 10 most of the students are from gatewala even in top 100 if you see right uh, 30 40 percent students minimum 30 40 percent students are from the gate wall itself and our team for aerospace engineering is also very very strong and uh, uh, like if someone wants to prepare a systematic way if someone wants to prepare for aerospace engineering then uh, in a systematic manner then i would say uh, they must have to look at the uh, the the offerings that uh, the, the structure that is provided by the gatewala so this is basically for the student who are doing their btech for from uh, uh, aerospace engineering now come to the next one next point uh, that uh, what about the student who are doing their uh, btech from mechanical electrical electronics whether they should write the aerospace engineering or not so believe or not even this year believe or not this year mechanical air 3 sanket tupkar right there is one student he's a he's a student of physics wala gate wala he got air 3 in mechanical engineering he have an option of multiple government jobs he have an option of ioc ntpc bel many any psus right any psus any organization like bar anything anywhere they he can go right but 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 he chosen the aerospace engineering in isc bangalore so you can see that uh, aerospace engineering is not just engineering it is it is a dream it is a dream believe me when the first time i heard about uh, story of uh, dr apj abdul kalam i was even motivated i was even motivated for this particular branch so this is very very important now so i personally feel that see for mechanical student xc is one of the very good option xc engineering sciences is very good option to opt as a second paper the another option can could be uh, pi or aerospace so in aerospace also there are multiple subjects which are going to be common like thermodynamics so thermodynamics as well as uh, okay thermodynamics fluid mechanics even one subject is here one more the strength of material strength of material and some part of some part of uh, therium machines some part of therium machines these subjects are common here please listen here again means thermodynamics fluid mechanics 
strength of material and some portion of thelium machines are common in mechanical as well as aerospace engineering correct so if you want you can pursue for that then if a civil student if you talk about for a civil student structures strength of material and uh, material science uh, th these are these are the basically common subjects then uh, even for double e and i n uh, some branches some little bit knowledge of control system and uh, propulsion some knowledge is there but very rare only hardly for double e and i n hardly 5% syllabus is common with the with the uh, aerospace otherwise uh, it is completely different okay the another very important point is that uh, uh, very important point that especially in mechanical especially in mechanical uh, crowd is very very high mechanical civil cs crowd is very very high even if you want to get a, a good good uh, score if you want good score good rank and you want to pursue for mtech you want to pursue mtech from aerospace engineering especially then i would say you can go for this because here the number of students who are appearing for the gate exam is very very less that is very very less correct so uh, for PSU's number of vacancies are less okay but uh, if you talk about the IITs and ITs or ISC Bangalore if you want to pursue MTech then this is one of the uh, better option now you can see the opportunities now this slide is equally important for the people who are right who, who are uh, uh, going to write the gate exam through aerospace or the student who are actually doing BTEC from their aerospace engineering. So the ISC Bangalore, one of the most finest institute for aerospace engineering. Then IIT Madras, Kanpur, Bombay have very good placement in aerospace engineering. Then there are many uh, uh, many PSUs and central government jobs like ISRO. ISRO is not a PSU basically. ISRO, DRDO, HAL, NAL, uh, ADA. So these are the top government jobs right top government jobs uh like uh, which offers for aerospace engineering right so i personally feel, uh, feel you should write this exam okay now uh, uh okay this point i already told you that uh nirvan 2025 right the, the one event happened a few days back one event happened nirvan 2025 and in those, that event, we already launched aerospace branch, right? Earlier, uh, up to last year, we are not providing any separate course for aerospace engineering. If any aerospace student want to prepare, then he can enroll for a mechanical one and only common subject he can prepare. But now aerospace engineering is a separate branch in Gatewala. And uh, currently, some, um, some offer is also going on. Uh, uh nirvan 2025 71 up to 71 percent off is there for a all the gate and esc batch whether you are from a, it is not only for aerospace whatever your branch whatever your branch you can uh off like you can get up to 71 percent off okay now uh come to the another one that uh in this is the in aerospace there is interdisciplinary flexibility see whenever you are designing any aircraft or you are designing any uh, rocket or something is only mechanical engineering required no the engine is engine knowledge is required mechanical engine there are many control system electronics is required there are many much more programming computer science is required right uh, there is there is lot of things right so aerospace engineering is not just a like just a kind of engineering it is kind of interdisciplinary flexibility is there so if someone is going for uh, this aerospace engineering then in future they have multiple option to explore okay right, right. now you can see that uh, from last uh, 5 to 10 years right last 5 to 10 years there is a huge work huge work is going on on this space sector right and uh, even even you you can see that isro have uh, uh, done some very excellent job right even drdo also 
and uh, rocket and this missiles and all these things you can see right because now the world actually world required peace right there are you can see that war is going on in in number of countries nowadays right so every country want to save itself right so they actually required all these things so there is a good scope of uh, aerospace engineering correct so i hope you all are clear here so basically the conclusion of this particular session if i conclude you then the student who are doing b tech from aerospace engineering and uh, i personally suggest that they have to write the gate and uh, i personally suggest one more thing that you can uh, uh, you can prepare with the gate wala gate wala team is excellent i would say and have a very good track record of producing uh, great ranks then the second very important one the second very important one that the student who are doing their uh, btech from mechanical xc no sorry mechanical civil electrical electronics and uh, they can choose they can choose the aerospace engineering as their second option if they want to go for aerospace field okay so this is basically all about for this session but still if you have any doubt you can write in the comment box i will reply thank you thank you very much